Hi, my name is Raymond, the product manager of Uno 2000. This video will show you the Uno 2271G concept and assembling process based on the different configurations and the mounting kit you selected. Uno 2271G is the world's smallest dimension IoT gateway with three different types of standard configurations. E21 is a one-layer compact size system with two Gigan LAN, one USB 3.0, SDMI output, and 10 to 30 volts wireless DC input. E22 is based on E21 and add a second layer chassis with the extra three USB 2.0. E23 is based on the E21 as well and add extra two COM port on the second floor and a thin rail mounting kit at behind. If you have extra expansion requests, more than these two standard models, you have to purchase second stage chassis implement the extra idle based on an E21 model. For second layer extension kit assembling process, first, you have to remove the bottom cover of UNO. To implement idle, please take the second stage chassis, EKAE. You can find the reserved screw from the first chassis assembling the idle bracket and the EKAE. Install idle mini PCI card on a UNO 2271G slot and use reserve screw to assemble the EKAE and first stack chassis. Last step is to assemble the bottom cover back. If you have DIN rail mounting request, E23 has a defaulted DIN rail mounting kit on rear cover already. So there's no need to purchase extra DIN rail kit for this model. But for Echo 21, and Echo 22, you have to order DINRAIL kit DMKE for your DINRAIL application. And there are two mounting locations, one on the bottom and one on the rear cover. Besides DINRAIL, all models also support a pole mount application with an optional kit we call the PMKAE, which separates to two parts. Pole mounting kit uses exactly the same location as DINRAIL mount. And following is the PMKE assembling process. First step is to assembling the first part of a pole mount kit on UNO. And then use second part of the pole mount kit to screw together with the first part and cross the pole you tend to fix. You can easily adjust the position of UNO through pole mount kit. The last section is about the lockable kit on UNO. This is the lockable kit we call the LKAE, which can fix the external cable preventing vibration issue. First step is to assemble the lockable screw on UNO, and then adjust the screw on the lockable kit to fix the cable dimension and length. Use the plastic lock stopper to fix the cable and then screw tight again to make sure all cable are fixed. It. Thanks for your attention. Please contact Raymond.Lee if any question unclearly. Thank you.